Pink Fairy Armadillo The Pink Fairy Armadillo is the smallest and cutest species of armadillo. It is on the list of threatened species and is found in the sandy plains, dunes, and grasslands of Argentina. The Pink Fairy Armadillo is a nocturnal creature that survives mostly on insects and plants. Okapi The okapi is an animal native to the Democratic Republic of Congo in Africa. Although the stripes make many people believe okapi are related to zebra, they are actually closer to giraffe. Okapi are solitary creatures and come together to breed. They are herbivores, mostly eating leaves, grass, and other plants. Glaucus atlanticus. These little dragon-like creatures are often only about a few inches long and can be found in the Indian Pacific Oceans. The blue dragon floats upside down in order to blend the blue side of them with the water, and the silver side with the surface of the ocean. This tiny dragon feeds on creatures like the man o war and can even deliver a sting similar to it, the maned wolf. The maned wolf is often found in the grasslands of south, central west, and southeastern parts of Brazil. It is neither related to wolves nor foxes despite its appearance and name but is actually closer to dogs. The maned wolf hunts alone and primarily eats both meat and plants. Fossa The fossa is a carnivorous animal located in Madagascar. Despite having many traits similar to cats, it is more closely related to the mongoose. The fossa is only found in forest habitats and can hunt in either daytime or night. Over 50% of its diet happens to be lemurs. Japanese spider crab As the name suggests, the Japanese spider crab inhabits the waters surrounding Japan. In many parts of Japan, this crab can be considered a delicacy but can be considerably difficult to catch. The Japanese spider crab can grow to 12 feet long from claw to claw. There is only one sea creature, amongst similar species, that beats the weight of a Japanese spider crab, the American lobster, Pacu fish. Look closely at the teeth, do they look familiar? This fish is found in the waters of South America. This fish, while related to the piranha, can actually grow much larger. They can also be found in rivers like the Amazon and is an aid to the fishing industry. Unlike the piranha, Pacu mostly only eats seeds and nuts, though can still create nasty injuries to other animals if need be. Slow loris. The slow loris is a nocturnal creature found in Southeast Asia. While very adorable, the loris's teeth are actually quite venomous. The toxin on their teeth can also be applied to fur through grooming to protect its babies from predators. Oftentimes these creatures forage and spend time alone, although can on occasion be seen with other slow lorises. Apart from their toxic teeth, the slow lorises have another defense mechanism, in which they move nearly completely silently in order to prevent discovery. Angora rabbit. These cute, fluffy rabbits are among the hairiest breeds of rabbit of both wild and domestic types. These rabbits originated in Turkey although managed to spread throughout Europe and was even brought to the United States in the 20th century. These rabbits are often bred for their soft wool which can be made into clothing and often get rid of their own coats every three to four months. Axolotl. The axolotl or the Mexican salamander is often spotted in lakes in various places around Mexico. These little salamanders are amphibious although often spend their adult lives strictly in the water. However, the population of these cute creatures is dwindling due to non-native predators and the continued urbanization of Mexico. The axolotl eats small worms, insects, and fish in order to survive.